Okay guys, welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to go over the weekly update. We're going to start off with the Pariah. That's the podium vehicle this week. Uh, I think this thing is worth winning. I think it's a really nice vehicle. So, go try and win it if you can. Uh, we're on two characters if you want. We're on one. doesn't matter. Just try and win. Anyway, we're going to try and spin the wheel. And we're going to see if we're going to try and get it. Then we'll go over what double money is this week. Yeah, that's some pretty cool ones too, actually. And we're not gonna win it, but we'll see what we get. Okay guys, so we've got the Weenie SC Rally as this week's vehicle added into GT Online. Honestly, people have been saying it's a bad car, but I don't think I hate the way it looks. I like the way it looks. I might even consider getting it because I quite like the way it looks. I might even buy it twice. Uh, but anyway, that's not, we're not here to talk about that right now. We're gonna go over the double rewards so let's get started with the taxi stuff because there's a lot of taxi stuff to go over real quick okay guys so we've got some rewards for the um taxi job so if you complete one drive like pickup you get 100k if you complete 10 of them you will get an additional 100k and i think that's also including the first one and if you complete 20 of them you get an additional 100k so all together you're gonna get 100k uh, uh, uh sorry 300k but if you add it up on this other two you'd probably get somewhere around three hundred and sixty thousand dollars. so that's actually not too bad money this week and also taxi services are double rewards another thing you get with the uh 20 uh deliver missions or whatnot you also get the Mustard Valley and Mustard Valley Cut Jackets. Anyway, I'll put a picture on the screen right now so you guys can see what it is. And there's a bunch of other rewards for the PS5 and Xbox Series X, but I'm not really going to go over them because um, I just find it a pain. Anyway, let's go to the first dose hard missions. Same rewards apply there. Basically with all the liveries and stuff that you could get from completing the DAX hard missions. But I think there's also an additional one as well. But I don't even think these are worth doing anymore to be very honest with you guys. Um, the only reason I don't think these are worth doing is because you can't use the Vigilante or any cars in those missions anymore. They've removed all vehicles which really sucks. So I wouldn't even bother doing them but I'll show you anyway. Here's a picture of the main four but there's also an additional one as well. You can get the pump shotgun for completing the first six dose missions on hard difficulty. And then there's all those other rewards you get for completing those things. But yeah. Anyway, those are the those are the rewards you get for completing those first dose missions. But honestly, don't bother. I don't think it's I don't think it's worth your time. Okay, so the next thing we're gonna go over is more double rewards. Okay, let's start with the next thing. The double rewards for this is We've got double rewards on all arena war and the ap i guess so if you want to go for it now is probably your best chance to do it if you want to go for it now is your best chance to do it i probably might do it too because i actually quite like arena war motor wars is also double rewards this week okay so let's go to the discounts this week i don't think there's a whole lot of discounts but i'm going to show you guys this Okay, so let's go to the discounts. Okay, we're going to start off with Arena War. There's 40% off all workshops and modifications. The Zan Tournament is 40% off this week. The Devastate 8 is 30% off. And the Italian GTO is 30% off this week. Honestly, these guys have been very lazy with the updates. So I think that's all the double money has to offer. Uh, let me just put the Twitch Prime and the uh, GTA Plus on the screen right now. And yeah, let's move on to the test rides and stuff that you could do there. Okay, so we have a new prize ride. And I have to win it. <laughs> I have to win this car. It's the Winky Dinky. We have to win the Winky Dinky. Um, <laughs> um, the street series races come first for three days in a row. I have to win this thing. It's the winky dinky for God's sake. I have to have my winky dinky. Um, <laughs> um, okay, we've got the test drives. We've got the Italian GTO, the Ennis Remus, 
and we have the Obi Tailgater S. So I can't wait to test those things out for you guys. Let's move on to Simeon's place and then we'll move on to the luxury place and I think that's going to wrap up the video. Okay, so for these test rides, oh my god, look at that Zantorno. That Zantorno looks really cool. Anyway guys, we've got the Zantorno obviously, like I just said. We also have the Benefactor Shrilung GT, I can't pronounce that, for god. Okay, we've got the D-Class Vamos and we have the... Uh, god, I can't pronounce it. The Strider Devastant, I can't pronounce these, man. And most of these are, most of these are muscle cars. D-Class Impaler, which is a basically a an arena war vehicle. Um, so yeah, I can't wait to test those ones out as well. Let's go to the luxury place now, see if we've got anything special there. Even though it's not really that cool anymore. Okay, so it looks like we've got the Devastate 8. And we've got the Wingy SE Rally. Honestly, I quite like the look of the rally, but I want to get a closer look at it. Hold on, let's uh, take a closer look at it. Okay, I do like the look of this car. I might consider getting it, but I'm not going to get it from here. I think they cost a little bit more, so I'm not going to worry about it from here. I'll get it from from another place. And I, and I believe this is also an HSW vehicle too. Anyway guys, that's going to wrap up the video guys. If you guys enjoyed it, leave a like. Subscribe. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.